Yes, we Welcome are. to Dogwood News. I'm Melissa Druin. And I'm Brooklyn Sullins. So I heard Alyssa signed with Cameron earlier this week. Oh, so she gets to practice with Coach D? <clears throat> <laughs> yeah, actually, I caught up with her. Roll the footage. Hi, I'm Alyssa, and I'm here with Alyssa. So I heard you recently signed with Cameron for softball? I did, Tuesday. So how do you feel about that? Are you kind of excited? I'm really excited to play with Coach D again and just have a college opportunity to play. So what position do you play? I play shortstop. Oh, well, thank you for talking to us. Is there anything else you'd like to say? <laughs> thank you for your time. Back to y'all at the desk. And go. Congratulations, Alyssa, on working with Coach D. Mm -hmm. All right, my name is Christian. You already know that. We're here to talk about e-books that you could buy for $50 today. Just see Miss Hewitt if you want it. Envelope, put your money in it, and you give it to her. See it. <clears throat> oh, sorry. I didn't see you there. We were too busy looking at this yearbook. Have you guys ever been worried that your high school memories will just die off? <gasps> well, if you get a yearbook today, your memories will live forever, like Miss Fritz's. And it's only $50. Oh crap. <laughs> That's Miss Fritz. In other news. Oh my god! Yeah. Oh, me. In other news. Um, we now have basketball passes. It'll come back on. Keep it rolling. And we now have basketball passes. In other news. Shh. Are we caught up with Zeke to talk about it? Talk about what? Basketball, basketball passes. passes. Roll, roll film. Yeah. Hi, I'm Brooklyn Sullins, and I'm here with senior basketball player Ezekiel Henson. Will you tell us a little bit about these basketball passes? Uh, these basketball passes, they cost $10. Just go to the middle school or high school office. And what it does is you just go to the game or whatever, to wherever you pay for your ticket, show them the pass, walk in for every home game, and you won't have to pay anything else. Uh, so please come support the basketball team as we try to make the state. Sounds like a good deal. Thank you, Ezekiel. You're welcome. Good luck to all the basketball players. Also, good luck to Nick Callen on his scuba audition tomorrow. Stupida, it's scuba. Gazoon type. <laughs> Roll film. Hey, I'm Brooklyn Sons, and I'm here with Nick Callen. Nick, please tell me about this audition you're going to. Well, it's scuba to South Central Regional Honor Man. You go this Saturday and you audition for it. I hope you make it. There, there's probably like 100 people that can make it out of South Central Region. And what instrument are you going to play? Trumpet. Have you auditioned for this before? Yes. I've done it every year since seventh, eighth grade, and I've made it every year since then. So what happens when you make it? Then you go and get to play in a band in January, and you get to play in a band full of great players from the South Central region. That's awesome. Congratulations on all your past accomplishments, and I hope you do well this year. Thank you. Good luck, Nicholas. I heard Casey caught up with Miss Murr to talk about the trip to Spain. Senora Murr. <laughs> I'm Casey and I'm here with Miss Murr. Uh, we're going to talk about the Spain trip. So, uh, when are your goals? We are going to be going next July and we'll be there for nine days. That's cool. Um, how many students do you have going? So uh, we have 17 students that are going. Um, what activities are I doing on the trip? Well, we'll be going to um, Madrid, to the capital. We'll get to go to the King and Queen's Palace and take a tour. Um, see some of the big plazas there in Madrid. Um, we'll also be um, getting to go and spend a day on the beach, our very last day, because um, we'll be working our way down to the coast and just see a lot of neat and different things. That'll be fun. Is there anything else you would like to say about it? Um, we're selling raffle tickets, so if you want to buy raffle tickets to help um, students on the trip, um, that'd be good. They're selling thunder tickets as well as we're raffling off a calf. Oh, we're going to be giving the calf to somebody after we butcher it. So. Oh, okay. All right. Well, thank you for interviewing me and have fun on your trip. All right. Thank you. Here are some announcements for this week. On Monday, December 2nd, the special education teachers are meeting at 2.45 p.m. High School Boys Basketball is at Hershey at 5. Wrestling at Cash is at 6 p.m. Tuesday, December 3rd. High School Basketball is hosting St. Mary's at 4 p.m. in the new gym. Wednesday, December 4th. FCCLA, DECA, BETA are going to Oklahoma City to feed the children. Thursday, December 5th. High School Girls Basketball at the Altus Tournament. Friday, December 6th. High School Girls Basketball, the Altus Tournament, wrestling at Newcastle Tournament at 1 p.m. 
Saturday, December 7th. High school girls basketball at Altus Tournament. Wrestling at Newcastle Tournament. Tournament, not tournament. <laughs> <laughs> <Need> the desk. <laughs> Let's end this episode of Dog One News with a trivia fact. 50 years ago, on November 22nd, John F. Kennedy was assassinated. Really? <laughs> <laughs> See y'all next time. Seniors 2014. That's all I'm going to do tonight is I'm going to go.